and that's the business side the the marketing and the promotion and and stuff like that which is something that i i, I talk to a lot of my customers because many of the people that buy cmos from us they're also cmos sellers and so sometimes you know people find challenging in and how to sell their product especially when you're trying to sell a product that um you've never sold before and is new to the market and not people many people know about it and so what i was explaining to someone i was talking to today or was it today or yesterday either way it's 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 like a numbers game and you really got to get out into your community as much as you possibly can and let people know what you have people are not going out and asking do you sell cmos do you do this but if you say to someone have you ever heard of cmos guaranteed they either haven't heard of cmos or someone has told them about cmos or they've tried it so that's you know what i mean and i think we need to find more ways to bring the topic up in conversation especially if you're in a group and stuff and people ask you like what do you do do you know what i mean you should almost have like a pitch made up in your head or practice so that when people are like oh what do you do you know you could say oh well you know I work on the labor, but I have a side business that I do this and this and this as I sell CMOS and I've helped this many people do CMOS and you just got to tell like a few minutes about who you are and I guarantee you just the mere mention of CMOS is going to have people curious as to what is that, where does it come from, you know what I mean, what, you know, how do you, how do you consume it, what's it about, you know what I mean, I guarantee you if I had a cooler full of gel in my car, I could probably sell 50 jars of CMOS a day. Well, no, I'm over exaggerating, but I could sell a lot. You know what I mean? And the point I'm trying to say is that people need to know you got the product. 